हेलो आई एम डॉक्टर लोपा मुद्रा प्रधान एसोसिएट कंसल्टेंट ऑब्स्टेटिक्स एंड गाइनोकोलॉजी एट सक्रा वर्ल्ड हॉस्पिटल द कॉज ऑफ पी सी ओ एस इज नॉट येट नोन बट इट इन सम पेशेंट्स इट कैन रन इन फैमिलीज इफ योर मदर आंट और सिस्टर हैज पी सी ओ एस देन योर चांस ऑफ हैविंग पी सी ओ एस इज इंक्रीज पी सी ओ एस इज ऑल्सो एसोसिएटेड विद सर्टन एबनॉर्मल हॉर्मोनल लेवल्स विच कैन लीड टू ऑल द सिम्टम्स ऑफ पी सी ओ एस नॉर्मली every ovary releases small amounts of testosterone in pcos the testosterone which is secreted by the ovary is more as compared to normally the second hormone which can get abnormal is insulin hormone insulin hormone usually helps to control the blood glucose levels in pcos the body is resistant to insulin thus the body tries to produce more amount of insulin in order to control the blood glucose levels these higher levels of insulin leads to all the symptoms like weight gain irregular periods difficulty in becoming pregnant long term health consequences with pcos are diabetes one in one to two in 10 women may have diabetes if they have pcos and it is and the blood sugar levels are not controlled they may also have higher chance of having high blood pressure and high blood pressure can lead to heart disease there is increased chance of having endometrial cancer that is the cancer of the lining of the uterus uh, those women who have fewer than 3 or 4 menstrual cycles in a year in those women the lining of the uterus becomes thickened and that can lead to endometrial cancer this is seen in a small number of women this can be prevented by taking progesterone tablets the 5 day course to get periods every 2 to 3 months or by taking oral contraceptive pills or by taking a intrauterine contraceptive device which has progesterone in it so these are few methods by which the risk of endometrial cancer can be reduced the other long term health consequences are mood swings and depression